We are all familiar with the classic signs and symptoms of a stroke. One-sided weakness, facial droop and arm drift are just a few of the signs and symptoms that patients may display when suffering a stroke in the right or left hemispheres of the brain. But when a stroke occurs in the brainstem or cerebellum, patients may not display these classic signs and symptoms that we've come to rely on. A stroke in the brainstem and cerebellum may leave the patient without any arm drift, hemiparesis, or slurred speech. Instead, they may display problems with coordination. To identify these patients, you will need to modify your traditional stroke assessment. One effective evaluation method is to test hand-eye coordination. Holding your index finger at arm's length from the patient, ask them to touch their nose and then reach out to touch your finger. A healthy patient will likely be able to perform this task without any difficulty. A patient suffering from a cerebellar stroke, however, may struggle with spatial orientation. A second test evaluates coordination of the lower extremities. Ask the patient to lift each leg separately and slide their heel along the opposite shin. Again, ischemia in the cerebellum may cause a patient great difficulty with this task. Remember that not all strokes will present with the same classic signs you'll expect to see. If you identify any acute signs or symptoms of a stroke, it's critical that you treat the patient as a priority one. Transport strokes patients to the closest, most appropriate stroke center and ensure the best odds of recovery. As always, we recommend you check your local protocols to ensure there are no conflicts with the widely accepted information provided during this acne minute. Visit American CM for more education about stroke and stroke assessment and earn credits towards your EMS license. Thanks for watching and have a great day.